Good evening. On behalf of AIJ and the Twinning Center, thank you for joining us for this satellite session on Twinning this evening. For many of you uh, who are unfamiliar with AIJ, we're an NGO based here in Washington, D.C. We were founded in 1992 by leading representatives of the U.S. hospital sector and health sector and tasked with the mission of advancing global health by promoting and supporting in an organized fashion volunteer-driven twinning partnerships between health-related institutions and professionals in the U.S. and overseas. The HIV-AIDS uh, Twinning Center program was established, as, uh, as Philippe indicated, in 2004 with funding from PEPFAR through HRSA. Under our agreement, HRSA and, C and U.S. government agencies and countries, such as CDC, USAID, and the Department of Defense, provide funding essentially to harness the twinning methodology to support PEPFAR objectives in target countries. The Twinning Center focuses on creating voluntary peer-to-peer -peer relationships that in this case are targeted toward improving HIV-AIDS related services by strengthening underlying institutional and human resource capacity. The Twinning Center accomplishes this primarily through institutional twinning partnerships, in many cases involving U.S. partner institutions in North-South collaborations, but increasingly embracing South-South twinning, enabling leading institutions from one African country to support and mentor counterparts in another. The Twinning Center also supports a voluntary health care corps, the VHC, which places highly skilled professionals on the ground for volunteer assignments between three and 24 months. To date, the VHC has placed over 90 volunteers who have contributed over 75 person years of professional uh, expertise. These volunteers provide uh, needed technical assistance, they mentor counterpart professionals, they serve as role models, and they often end up filling key leadership and management gaps during system transition.